This show is sponsored by PSE Archery, Millennium Tree Stands, Hunter Safety System, Third Arm, Extreme Archery Products, Axe Broadheads, The Chase Deer Scent, Plot Watcher, and Antler Insanity. Welcome to Rally Hunt Club. In this webisode, we're going to be talking about our Axe Broadheads. We're actually going to be putting the broadheads on our arrows as we go. Um, Chuck. Chuck and them have already killed some animals, some pronghorns and some elk, and Ty and I are getting ready to go and um, shoot some deer this weekend. So stay tuned and I'll talk to you about them. The Antler Insanity guys came out with these broadheads and we're glad to be associated with Kenneth Lancaster and them of, of um, Antler Insanity. Um, I, we're go I'm going to be shooting the Axe broadhead, which is the flagship one. It's got a two inch cutting diameter as you can, as you can see. It's a really smooth aerodynamic one. I'm going to take them out of the package and put them on my um, arrow. They also, they also sent us some of the what they call the bone crusher. Now the Axe has the blade, I'll show you a close up here. The axe has the blade that that will cut as it as it inserts, and it's expandable as you know as it goes in. It will expand to um, cut the deer. Now the bone crushers are very similar, except instead of having the cutting blades, it has the chisel point. So we might shoot some of those too. Both of them great broadheads. Some of the best deals out there. You get five of these. I think they're selling them for thirty-five or thirty-nine. You get five of these for normally the price of the other guys three. So that's a much better deal. Now Tad's shooting a lower poundage bow. He's actually going to be shooting the um, hatchet, the, the 100 grain hatchet. Now both those other um, expandable broadheads were 100 grain. And he's going to be shooting the 100 grain hatchet. And um, it's a fixed three bladed broadhead as you can see in the pictures I'm showing you now. So come along as we put these on our broadheads. We're going to be using some lighted knocks too. I'm not naming any um, manufacturers of who are using the light knocks because they're not sponsored, but we are. We did buy some light knocks and we're going to try them out. We're going to shoot a couple times into an older target, make sure they're flying true, and we'll be ready to go um, this weekend. So keep watching and um, we'll show you as we put these things on. So, and thanks for watching Rally Hunt Club. I'm trying to cut myself with these things. <laughs> That one's stuck a little bit. There they are. You getting, watch me screwing me? Mm-hmm. You get that? Get it? Mm hmm. You gonna hit something with that? Yes, sir. Knocking this one. We'll have to index it. All right, that one's ready, Tataroo. Are these yours? Yeah, he's mine. He want to get this. Cut 
cut myself with these. And these two are ready to go. See how they're deployed there? This one here. See, that's what's going on. This one here. I need to roll the band back. Roll them over a little bit like this. Like that. And get them like that, and then make sure you're on the blade side of them, and then pop them all on the other side, and then they're good to go. Got it? And then for me, you got me? Mm -hmm. Bad mama jama. She's good to go. Focusing problem. What about now? Okay, it's a little bit better. There you go, it's a lot better now. If you like this show, watch our other shows at hunt365.tv. You can also subscribe to our YouTube channel by clicking the button on the screen or connect with us and receive notices of all our new episodes by liking our Facebook page.